Oh man, I've, I've been trying to uh, trying to take care of myself better. You know, I tried out this Taekwondo stuff. I don't know if any of you guys do this stuff, but you gotta have a uniform. They call it a gi. So I go to sign up with the Korean master, and he says, Oh, Mr. John, you a big boy. We don't have a gi to fit you. We gonna have a special order. Get you a gi. And I can't tell him to go to hell, because he can kick my ass. Hey, have you guys ever been so drunk you thought it was the perfect time to do a science experiment. <laughs> I can tell you now from personal experience that if you mix the proper amount of Jack Daniels with Taco Bell, you can actually light your own shit on fire. <laughs> when comedians are first starting out, uh, you know, they, they take stage time anytime they can get it. Anywhere, too. So, uh, the other... Day, I took a gig over at the senior center in Rochester. Yeah, it was kind of a kind of a kind of a challenging crowd. But the reason that I tell you that is because my Bob Hope impersonation almost got me laid. Don't worry, I passed on it. The, little, the lady had Parkinson's. I was thinking about that hand job, you see. You know who's a real douchebag? Yeah, other than me. That Ryan Seacrest. Yes. You know, aren't you glad that American Idol is over? I, I just, God, I get so obnoxious announcing that. This is American Idol! <laughs> you know, you don't have other people doing their jobs that way. You're not going to get a knock on the door that says, This is a Domino's pizza! <laughs> you don't go to the clinic and they say, This is a barium anima! <laughs> Sometimes you go to a comedy club though and a guy says, This is a shitty joke! <laughs> you know, comedians are always talking about relationships too. Um, the problem is I really kind of don't have any. <laughs> Unless you had the pizza guy. For a fat guy, ordering a pizza is kind of like getting a hooker. <laughs> well, think about this. I can get exactly what I want. You know? Maybe this time I want a thin one. <laughs> maybe I want a thick one. <laughs> a little bit extra saucy. <laughs> but when it gets to my door, it better be hot. <laughs> then at the end of the night, something's gonna get stuffed in a cardboard box and tossed in a dumpster. <laughs> high one time and I'm walking down the street and I thought I saw a woman like being taken advantage of. I'm like, man, should I stop that dude or would that make me a cock blocker? <laughs> no, fuck that. I don't want to block cock. You know, and just keep walking. You're just fucking nuts. You don't know. Oh. I was recently uh, home, stoned out of my mind and I was watching, uh, they had this little thing on NASCAR. Like, what the fuck is with NASCAR? Why is that so huge? Let me tell you something. The only thing you have to do to drive NASCAR don't fall asleep and don't piss yourself. <laughs> and it makes me wonder, like, what were these fuckers doing before NASCAR? Like, were there retards following around chariot racing? <laughs> stay with me, stay with me. <laughs> okay, I wasn't, but he asked, all right. <laughs> no, I mean, like, were there people in ancient times with, like, junk horses in their lawn? <laughs> Fucking all these like horrible celebrities, like there was a Ben Hernhart Jr. <laughs> <laughs> Who rose to fame after his dad died in a freak explosion. Oh Horses aren't even combustible, how did that happen? Kapa! Oh yeah, so you guys played it off like you don't know NASCAR, but now you're offended. You have to understand that to get offended, I'm on to you. <laughs> And they had like all the chariots were spray painted with different products. <laughs> there was like fucking Campbell's leeches. I'm bleeding out. <laughs> Egyptian slaves get the job done. <laughs> and of course, my favorite medieval endorsement, Armor All. Actual Armor All. I recently got a blowjob the other day. Give it up, guys. Yeah! 
Yeah. 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 After the blowjob, this girl looks at me and she goes, you know, I don't really like it, but your cum tastes good. Oh, yeah. Is there a way for a woman to say that and not sound like a whore? Oh, what are you comparing it to? Are you at the Sam's Club of Ejaculates? Ooh, I don't know, this one's a little cheesy. <laughs> the flavor's awesome on this one, but the dispenser's smaller. <laughs> I saw this homeless guy with a sign that said, Will work for food? And I thought to myself, awesome. That guy's gonna swallow, he needs the money. <laughs> but I like to uh, install my wisdoms onto my nieces and nephews, they're awesome. Uh, so, uh, my nephew, who's uh, three years old, he uh, announced to the world that he wanted to be either an astronaut or a volcanologist. And I said, how do you make money studying Mr. Spock, you nerd? And, uh, that's not even close. But uh, 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 we were eating supper one time, and uh, his favorite supper at the time was uh, popcorn shrimp, right? But he doesn't like the breading, he likes to pick them out, because that's a little treasure or something, whatever it is. Kids are weird. Uh, but he turns to me and he's like, Uncle Wayne? And I'm like, aha, he's going to ask me how do they get the shrimp inside of the breading. I know this one, because I eat a lot. Okay. What's up, buddy? He's like, how do you stab a bitch? Oh, and I'm like, ha <laughs> Okay. First they take the shrimp, right? And they dredge it in the batter, which is usually a, wait, what? What the fuck? What did you just ask me? Well... Timmy at school said he wanted to stab a bitch, and I just don't know how we're gonna do that. I'm like, whoa! Ah, wow! That, uh, you're probably gonna need a shank, right? <laughs> Grab something, you know, like a, a ruler or something. Get those plastic right? Sharpen it down on the sidewalk. That, that'll crap, right? You wanna tape the edges too, because you want a good grip on that thing, right? And you're probably gonna wanna do it under the monkey bars, because there's a lot of people, no witnesses. Stop them and pass it off, right? Remember Scarface? Remember Scarface? We watched that guy with all the powdered sugar, he cried a lot. Remember? Remember that movie? That was great. Wait, what are we talking about? Go to bed. 